Greetings, I'm going to show you how to make a chibi in New Doodle. The easiest way to do this is to pull a template off of Google. So I'll show you how to do that right now. First, tap the plus button, the new drawing button in the top right. Then you want to edit a photo. In order to use the paint bucket, your image has to be on the foreground and edit a photo, as you can see, puts your image on the foreground. I'm then going to choose Google as the source for loading my photo. So here's how this works. Search to find your image, tap through to the full image, and then double tap to import it into YouDoodle. Now I've already got something on my clipboard here for searching for a chibi template, so I'll do that now. So there's a lot of templates here. I'm just going to pick this first one. I'm going to single tap through and then usually there's this three dots icon where you can do view image to get the full size and then double tap it to bring it into you doodle. Great, that looks like that worked. So I'm probably going to crop this a little bit. There's no need for all that white space. Then I'm going to tap done. So now I have my chibi here and I would like to fill her in. To do that, I've already got the paint bucket tool selected there at the bottom. You can see that there's a lot of colors and options for templating and shading your chibi. I'm going to give her some fiery hair. I think that would be pretty cool. You can even zoom in to get the areas that are missed. That looks pretty good. I would like to give her some sparkly pants. So let's try one of these textures here. And let's just give her some blue, plain old blue shoes. Now if the paint bucket's not filling as much as you want, you can always raise the tolerance and then try some more. That looks a little better. Now I would like to give her a green face, of course, and probably a pretty yellow bow. And you can see I've almost finished with my chibi in a matter of seconds here. Her shirt's got to be really cool. Let's make her Egyptian style. That'll be fun. Oops, you can always undo if you make a mistake, so that's nice. And you have a chibi there in about a couple minutes. Oh, and if you want, you can give her a really cool background, like maybe the space background. Because who doesn't want an awesome space Egyptian chibi? All right, when you're done, there's a share button in the top left that you'll want to make sure you use to share your chibis on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and all manner of other places. So be sure to do that once you're done. Okay, I think that about covers it. I hope you enjoy making your chibis. Tag them with you doodle, Y-O-U-D-O-O-D-L-E on Instagram, and I may feature your chibi. Have a great day.